Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. You? Ah, good, good. Only that it's raining by my house. And you? Yes, here too, raining. Mm. Just like one hour raining, but it's good. It's good because when the class finish, ah, you sleep comfortable. No, no mm -hmm. hot. Mm -hmm. Good evening, guys. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you, Santiago? I'm good great, teacher. teacher. I need some rest, but I'm good. Good. And Santiago, is raining in your area? Yes, it's raining here. It's raining in Quetzaltepec City. I think in, in, in many parts of El Salvador, it's raining. Yes. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, guys. Good evening. How are Good you? Evening. Good evening, Noah. Nice to meet you. Thanks. Uh -huh. Nice to see you again. Okay. Mm -hmm. You are ready to play video games, Noah? Yes, teacher. Uh, I see. I see. Excellent. Excellent. All right. And Marvin, how are you? I'm fine. Thank you, teacher. And Marvin, what what do you do? I um, I I study uh, homework. Creo que se dice tarea, verdad? Correct. Oh, I see, see. Oh. Let's solve the homework all day. Uh, Marvin, are, do you study in the university? Yes, teacher. I study in the university. Architecture. Yeah, an architect. Uh huh. Um, I imagine. I imagine for. I see behind you. Uh huh. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, it's it, it's uh. Carrera is is degree or race or. No, no. Your career. It's career. Uh huh. My, my career. 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 It's it's necessary mm, more more instruments, but but necessary the 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 plane to 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 the building plane to the construction the building. Okay. All right. Good. Well, it's interesting. Everybody has a different career. Um, today, we're going to go ahead. We're going to learn a little bit about phrasal verbs. Okay. We are going to continue with our unit. It's unit 4.4. .4, okay. We're going to learn vocabulary to talk about services. Okay. Services and dating. For this, we have a small video. Let's watch the video and see what we can learn from the phrasal verbs. Hi, as you know and recall, we use phrasal verbs a lot in English. This time we'll show you a list of three words phrasal verbs that you may use when talking about services and dating. Work with me and stay and find out what we want you to do. Listen to the following list of three phrasal verbs. Then I will use them in a sentence so you have a better idea of what they mean. Take some time to make sense of them. I say at the end and see if you got the meaning right. Okay. Have you ever heard of these expressions or phrasal verbs? Do you know what they mean? That is new for me, teacher. Okay. All, all of them, Santiago, all are new. Yes, all. Okay, okay. Well, today we're going to learn the meaning. So listen, and we're going to learn the meaning for all of them. Broken up with, came up with, looking forward to, cut down on, keep up with, put up with, get along with, take care of. Jennifer has broken up with her boyfriend again. Kevin came up with a great idea for our class reunion. I'm not looking forward to typing my essay. 
Maybe I'll get it done professionally. My doctor says I'm overweight. I should cut down on fatty foods. Rob can keep up with his students in his Mandarin class. He should get a tutor. I can't put up with the noise on my street. I'll have to move. My girlfriend doesn't get along with her roommate. They're always fighting. Bill can take care of his own finances. He has an accountant manage his money. Okay. So the idea is we have many different expressions. With our partners, we're going to read the sentences and see if we understand the meaning. We are going to try to create the meaning from the example in the sentence, okay? So number one, Jennifer has broken up with her boyfriend, okay? What do you think is the meaning? Uh, meaning the broken teacher. Uh, relationship. Uh, what happened with the relationship, Santiago? Finish. Okay, very good. This is the idea. With your partner, you are going to create your understanding. It's okay. It's okay. No say. No problem. From what do you understand in the context? What do you think maybe is the meaning? Okay. It's not necessary that you know. Only necessary you can explain your ideas. Great. Okay. This Great teacher. It's in the WhatsApp group. If you are not sure, also you can check in the WhatsApp and you have the sentences. So with your partner, you discuss what do you think is the meaning? Yes? Yes, teacher. All yes, right. teacher. Good.
Okay, let's try number two. What do you think is number two? What do you think is the meaning? Kevin came up with a great idea. Here, teacher, in can this be. case, give a great idea. Okay, let's like give. Okay, good. Anybody else? Nice. Okay, we agree with give. Good, good idea. What about number three? What do you think is number three? Number three, no idea? I think mm -hmm. Mr. is to expect something or be excited about something that will happen or or don't don't be excited about it. Will be Okay. So be excited and here is not looking forward is not excited. All right, good. And, uh, not looking forward, teacher. Mm -hmm. I I I think that there is a person to to think and thinking on the future. Okay, maybe thinking on the future. Good. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's, well, it's like a review. Okay. All right. Good idea. We we're going to check in a moment. What about number four? What do you think was number four? Um, she have, in this case, maybe she, maybe he have to eat uh, less fatty foods. Okay. Less fatty foods. Okay. Maybe cut down is to do less. Okay. Do less, yeah. All right, good. What about number five? What do you think is number five? Mm -hmm. Tell me, tell me, what did you talk with your partners? What did you think was number five? Following. Rob can't follow in the other partners. Okay, good idea. Can't follow. Very nice. Good. Maybe, maybe Rob can't stay with the students. Okay, like the idea to stay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. And number six, good. Number six. I can't put up with the noise. What maybe is I can't put up with the noise? Hmm. It's like, um, be patient. Okay, good. Maybe it's be patient, put up with. Mm -hmm. And number seven. Get along with. My girlfriend doesn't get along with her roommate. They are always fighting. Hmm. Um, friendly or not friendly with something. Okay, so get along with is to be friendly. Mm -hmm. Nice. And the last hmm. one, take care of. It's uh, um and uh, in care is, uh, in the any space space in where you go take care uh, take care you pass a uh, street um uh, care the uh, with um uh, uh what 
out in the different uh, space. Okay, all right. Be careful. Let's take a look and see what they say. Let's see if we have some ideas. Be excited for something to happen. End a romantic relationship. Keep pace with someone or something. Tolerate something you don't like. Reduce the quantity of something. Have a good relationship with someone. Be responsible for something. Think of something. Develop an idea. Can you choose three phrasal verbs from the list and come up with your own examples? Don't forget to type them on a discussion box. Okay, so we have many different meanings, but we don't have the words, okay? So, be excited for something, okay? What do you think was the expression to be excited for something? Motivated, teacher. So from the vocabulary, which is it? Which is the correct vocabulary? Broken up with, came up with, looking forward to, cut down on, keep up with. What do you think is the correct vocabulary? So with your partner, that's what you're going to do. You're going to look at the picture and you're going to match. Have exactly the meanings there are the correct meanings. Do you match with the example from the other picture? Yeah. The mm -hmm. meaning is in the WhatsApp. It's okay to do? Yeah. Yes, I do. The two, and then you put what is the meaning for each word. The first one. You also the have first... the picture in WhatsApp. The first one is um Raquel, can you join the group? Carla. Hello, teacher. Hello, Carla. Do you have some problems? Uh, yes, I, I don't have an uh, internet connection. Okay. Let's try again. No problem. Okay.
Miguel, you okay? And Neda, any questions? And Neda, Neda? Hello, teacher. Uh, I enter late in the class, teacher. No problem, and Neda. Okay. Mm -hmm. How are you? How was your day? I'm fine. And my day is uh, very tired. What did because, you do today, Neda? Huh? What did you do? Um, I work in a, in the school. And today celebrate the cross day in my school. And I participate in the uh, in the celebration and with the students and have um, uh, others con sería sorry certamen como sería another event mm -hmm. about the performance for the language and literature the students performance the uh, the novels mm, okay very busy today Yes, very busy all day. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Let's take a look and see if we can match. Okay. So now that we practice with the partners and we have the ideas. Okay. Number one, be excited for is looking forward to, right? Looking forward to. What's letter B? End the romantic relationship. Broken out. Broken up with. Correct. Broken up with. Very good. What about C? Keep pace with someone or something. Keep out, teacher. No keep out, but keep up. Keep up with. Keep up with. Keep with. Uh -huh. Is to maintain. Mm -hmm. Get along with. Uh -huh. What about Tolerate something you don't like. Put up with. Correct. Put up with. This is to tolerate something. Very nice. Put up with. Mm -hmm. what about reduce the quantity of something. Put down on. Re repeat. Put down on. Cut down, down on. on. Good. Down cut down on. on. Yes. Reduces to cut down on. Mm -hmm. uh, have a good relationship with someone. Yeah. No. No. Get along, get al get along, get along with. with. Correct. Get along with. Get along with. Okay. Uh, be responsible okay. for something. Take care of. Take care of. Excellent. Take care of. And the last one, think of something, develop an idea. Came up with. Correct. Came up with. Came up with. Excellent. Any questions now that we have them? Thank <laughs> you. 
No question, teacher. No questions? All right. Let's listen to the rest of the video. Happen. End a romantic relationship. Keep pace with someone or something. Tolerate something you don't like. Reduce the quantity of something. Have a good relationship with someone. Be responsible for something. Think of something. Develop an idea. Can you choose three phrasal verbs from the list and come up with your own examples? Don't forget to type them on a discussion box. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to choose, we're going to go ahead, now that we learn about them, and we're going to talk about dating and make suggestions. Here, we're going to watch a small video about dating. Hi, let's begin by asking some questions. When, where, and how did you meet your wife? husband or that special someone type your answers on our discussion box as well i want you to listen to the conversation and find out what mike suggests james to do i need a date part a listen and practice this is so depressing i haven't had a date since angela broke up with me what can i do what about looking through the personal ads on the internet that's how i met amy Actually, I've tried that, but the people you meet are always different from what you expect. Well, why don't you join an online dating service? A friend of mine met his wife that way. That's not a bad idea. Also, it might be a good idea to check out those discussion groups at the bookstore. Yeah, if I don't meet someone, at least I might find a good book. What are some other good ways to meet people? What do you suggest? Share with us. Okay, so let's take a look at the conversation. Part A. In the conversation, any words, expressions, or phrases you don't know? The conversation check, is okay. Check, check out. Ah, let's see. Also, it might be a good idea to check out those discussion groups to investigate. To check out in this context is to investigate. Okay. Thanks. You're welcome. Any other words? okay so we're going to do two things one we're going to practice with our conversation we're going to practice with our partners and we're going to answer the, the question how do you meet your husband wife or significant other okay so remember number one practice the conversation we're going to practice the conversation in the both forms. First time, one James, and then my partner, Mike. And then we switch. I, Mike, and my partner, James. This is number one. Practice the conversation. Number two, answer the question. How did you meet your partner? Example, I met my partner on vacation in San Vicente. Okay? We are going to give details and describe. It's okay? Okay, teacher. All right. So remember, practice the conversation, and then we continue answering the question, how did you meet your partner?
is on our discussion box. As well, I want you to listen to the conversation and find out what Mike suggests James to do. I need a date. Part A. Listen and practice. This is so depressing. I haven't had a date since Angela broke up with me. What can I do? What about looking through the personal ads on the Internet? That's how I met Amy. Actually, I've tried that. But the people you meet are always different from what you expect. Well, why don't you join an online dating service? A friend of mine met his wife that way. That's not a bad idea. Also, it might be a good idea to check out those discussion groups at the bookstore. Yeah, if I don't meet someone, at least I might find a good book. What are some other good ways to meet people? What do you suggest? Share with us. Ready? In English, there are many ways to make suggestions. Grab a pen and paper and take notes. Remember, you may play the audio program and the explanation as necessary. Making suggestions with gerunds. What about looking through the personal ads? Have you thought about joining an online dating service? With infinitives. It might be a good idea to check out those discussion groups at the bookstore. One thing you could do is go to a discussion group at the bookstore. Okay, any questions about the conversation? No? No, okay. this, this conversation Not is, really. is, No. Okay, now tell me, how did your partner meet their boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife, or partner. How did they meet them? No practice with the partner. Yes, teacher, but I don't know, remember, um, where my classmate meet his his wife <laughs> alone um only remember that she she has 15 years old <laughs> 15 15 years old she's she's 15 years old when when he met When he met his wife, yes. Who was your partner? Um, Elvis. Elvis. All right, Elvis. Tell us, how did you meet your wife? Um, uh, I I met my wife when when she he is thirteen years old. Wow. But but no. I, I I don't have a relationship uh, in this moment. <laughs> you were in high school. Uh, in a neighborhood. Ah, in the neighborhood. Okay. Yes. Uh, and uh, when she she is eighteen years old, and I I. Uh, fall in love, <laughs> yeah, and and then uh, uh, married she and I, 
Okay, very nice, Elvis. You marry very quickly. Um, so so. <laughs> so so. Okay. okay, good, good. Another partner, tell me, how did your partner meet their husband, wife, or significant other? Mm, what happened? Tell me, tell me. Me, teacher. Okay, tell me. I I meet my wife when we were in high school. In what? In high school, in the first year. Yes. Uh-huh, continue, Santiago. What happened next? When did you get married? What happened? Well, uh, she she had a, she has a fifteen years old. Okay, she was. Two. Yes, she was fifteen years old. Mm -hmm. And me, sixteen years old. Okay. <laughs> and we have twenty years together. Congratulations. Sweet. 20 years is a long time. Yes, a long, long time, teacher. Help me, please. Como está con los audífonos, no lo Uh-huh, exactly. Honey, I love you so much, honey. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay, very good. Well, it's good. One more, one more person. How did you meet your husband, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend? Tell me. Okay, go ahead. Uh, I met my her, my girlfriend when I was we was on the school. I mean, like eight, eight grade. Uh, we are still with the relationship. Wow. And, and now I am. And now I am. Uh, 20 years 20 years old and, and she she is 20 years old okay so now you have many years the relationship like, yeah okay like let's see four eight like 10 years the relationship no <laughs> no <laughs> i mean four Four years for the relationship. Eighth grade, ninth grade, uh, first year. Eight. Second eight. year. Uh, no, eight. Eight years. Eight. No, 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 no. Eighth grade. Uh huh. Oh, grade. Exactly. So eighth, ninth, first ninth? year, ninth year, and then uh, you are together six years. Yeah. I like six so years. You are Two for friends and four with a relationship. Ooh, Eric, te costó, huh? Okay, two mm -hmm. years in the yes, friend zone. Two years in the friend zone. She was difficult. She was, was difficult. difficult. She was difficult. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. She was difficult. Very Ooh. difficult. Ooh. But no, <laughs> no, no, no more friends. <laughs> zone. Now ya salimos de ese. All right. I, I needed, I needed a lot of chocolate. A lot of chocolate. Oh, a lot of flowers. <laughs> yeah, of course. With a bad pool. Okay, good. All right. Now we're going to continue. We have the idea of describing the date, right? Here we're going to learn how to make suggestions. Suggestions with different vocabulary. Okay. Here we have gerunds, infinitives. Let's look at how to make different descriptions, how to make different suggestions. One thing you could do is to go to a discussion group at the bookstore. Ready? In English, there are many ways to make suggestions. Grab a pen and paper and take notes. Remember, you may play the audio program and the explanation as necessary. Making suggestions with gerunds. What about looking through the personal ads? 
Have you thought about joining an online dating service? With infinitives. It might be a good idea to check out those discussion groups at the bookstore. One thing you could do is go to a discussion group at the bookstore. One thing you could do is to go to a discussion group at the bookstore. With modals plus verbs. Maybe you could go to a chat room on the internet. With negative questions. Why don't you join a dating service? Making suggestions is not difficult. You just need to remember which forms to go together. Follow me. Making suggestions or giving advice. Number one, how about, what about, have you thought about, plus gerund. Number two, it might be a good idea. One thing you could do is, plus infinitive. Number three, maybe you could, plus base form of the verb. Number four, why don't you, plus base form of the verb. These are my problems. Can you give me some suggestions? How can I get along with my brother better? How can I improve my memory? I promise I'll read your suggestions. Okay, so that's what we're going to discuss in this moment, how to make different suggestions. So for sometimes, okay, sometimes we have the idea for meeting a boyfriend, meeting a girlfriend, okay? What do you recommend? Mm. Where is a good place? What is a good date? Imagine the first date. ¿Dónde era la primera cita? What's a good place to go to? This is the idea for it, okay? And you're going to give uh, examples or recommendations to your partner about the date. To help you in the what in the chat, I'm going to give you some questions to make it easier for you, okay? So you're going to have two links. Oops, one moment. Okay, there is link number one. And here is link number two. Do you have the two day, the two links? Yes, teacher. Yes? Yes, I okay. received. I received. Excellent. The idea is with our partner, only have a conversation about the dates, about dating okay. and the dates. Okay. Give opinion, recommendations, give a, a big detail with our partners when you answer. Okay, let's try it. Say okay. Solo en la sala lo compartió, verdad? No sé si aquí se ve, eh, se ve en la lo que compartió el link que compartió. Lo ven. Poquito, quiero ver. Mm -hmm. Sí. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, for me, I think so. Uh, meaning, um, my my girlfriend uh, is very important. Select plate. Plate is 
um de plays. É igual. Em Jardim de Celeste. <risos> é... oh, it's a beautiful place. Yes, yes. Yes. And, and you, Jose, can you tell us um, about um, my first date with my wife? Um, and we went to Mr. Donut for <laughs> a coffee. <laughs> it's not romantic. place but we're talking about a lot of things uh we we shared um it's, it's, uh, okay not yeah. rolling not rolling so hey, you know yeah, in my case two i two year of this uh you have made a house for my boss <laughs> Ah, okay. Yes. Okay. Right. okay. In my case, uh, first, uh, uh, this uh, first space with my partners uh, and a good relationship, relationship, relationship is very nice. Uh, I went visited uh, beach the the Kowano in this in Sonsonate. And then um, I visited different space and living, I don't know. <laughs> 50 years, a long, long time. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> 20 years and 50 years. And you know, years. How many years do you have married? 20 years old. 20 years. 20 years. 20 years married? Yes. Oh. I think 20 years uh, since... How do you say encadenado? <laughs> <laughs> we grillete? How do you say grillete? <laughs> Toxica? Oh, no. No. Teacher, Not really. Help us. How do you say it? <laughs> Chain. Chain. Yeah, we chain. <laughs> She's next to me. <laughs> chain. Okay. Oh, I'm so happy with, with her. Chain is... So, amazing with me. Uh-huh. Yes, must... because it's next That's to me. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what are some places you could go in your city? There is other restaurants. Okay. Uh, uh, they are mm, cheaper, cheaper. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the 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 most the most expensive in Chalatenango, mm -hmm. and but it's it's other it's other and the food is um is um very very good is in opinion with the better restaurants what in your opinion which is the better restaurant to to eat for for a first date oh uh it's a... Hello. yes well i'm 22 right now 22, 22. ah you're very young, you're young. young. Uh -huh. yeah you're very young <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 but no, you no, have no. A, a great idea for a, a date a perfect date mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it could be I think yes for example the beach mm -hmm. yeah or a coffee maybe a coffee a too coffee. some places in El Salvador the coffees the coffee shops are wrongly wrongly probably sometimes mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it depends mm -hmm. but, on the time. It depends on the time. Mm -hmm. For example, they also. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. So I have another. Wherever. I have another question. Okay. Is the first impression uh, important? 
significó como falta de, como decir, falta de comprensión. O, o por Yeah. eh, different, different objective in the future. In the future. Uh, Uh -huh. you. Entonces, stop. <ríe> Ah, uh, o sea que quiero ver. Um, you. You. Broken, broken up, ¿cómo era? Teacher, teacher, ¿cómo se dice? ¿Tuviste una, una relación con esa persona? Did you have Did relationship? you have relationship? Relationship. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's, it's, One, it's incredible. eh, ajá, it oh. was one year. Mm -hmm. One year. Eso, eso, for how many times? How many times? Hmm. Is... Your help? <laughs> help, please. <laughs> How we can say uh, zapatos formales? Ah, Casual formal shoes. shoes. Formal shoes. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you. Welcome. And just a formal shoes uh, well, uh, in the color black. Ah, she's wearing. She's 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 wearing formal shoes, black. All mm -hmm. right. Hmm. in the date In the, during the in day, the fifth yes. date. Ah, oh, okay. Hmm. This um, gloriously day, my wife wearing a uh, tennis puma. <laughs> Uh -huh. No sé si te acordás de eso, lo visitaron en alguna ocasión. No. <laughs> I, I couldn't have missed them. Uh, bueno. Well, my, I prefer to visit, uh, I mean, like a Mexican food. Ah, uh, Mexican food. Yeah, All right, it's very good. good. I, it, it, it's very good. It's good, it's good very good. I, it's good, the, the food Mexican. by the way, uh, Make you food. when I okay, good job. So we're discussing a little bit about the dates and good dates and bad dates and what to do. Okay. So think about, for you, what is a good date? The first date, what is a good first date? Miguel had a great idea for a first, best first date. Oh, what was the idea, Raquel? He said that the best dating is um, to talk. with the other people and a uh, calm place um is not necessary physical contact and um he he cho he choose the coffee shop but i think that the beach is a good place to talk with something and uh, because it's a very relaxing places so this is the the context. Okay. All right. Well, thank you so much for sharing the ideas. Maybe in our date for the next, we have some ideas for our next date. This is the idea. Remember, we're going to pause right there. Tomorrow, we're going to continue learning how to give uh, recommendations, suggestions, and other words. Okay? Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. Okay, guys. Thank you so much. Thank Have you. a nice night. Thank you, teacher. Thank Nice you. night. Good night. Bye. Everyone. Bye. Nice night. Bye. 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 Bye.